Duane, many congratulations to you. Can you describe your emotions right now? Uh, first, I want to say thanks Almighty God for giving us the opportunity to be champions. Um, and I want to commend my team. This is for them. Um, if it wasn't for them, um, this would not have been possible. So to my entire squad, to the owners, everybody, and most of all the people of St. Kitts, this is for them. They deserve this. They come out in their numbers. And thanks to the government for allowing fans to come into the stadium. They was our 12th man, and this is for them. It's the first time, as I mentioned, that uh, St. Kitts and Nevis Patriots, uh, as a team, has lifted this Hero CPL title. What made the difference this year, in your estimation? Belief, belief, and um, you know, giving people opportunities. For me, all I, I ask for the guys is for us to just back each other. It doesn't matter whether you perform or you don't perform, whether you play or you don't play. Let's support each other. Let's stay tight. Let's stay together. And, and, and um, you know, giving the young players the belief and the opportunity, especially Drake's. You know, the, my first net session I had with him, I said, hey, you're not an emerging player. You are one of my main players, and this tournament is for you. You know, Evan Lewis, naming him vice captain, he taking responsibility, scoring the motions for us. Um, you know, Shafir Rutherford, Fabian Allen, all these guys, the overseas guys who come in, sometimes they haven't played, but the energy on the bench is good. So, again, I can't ask for a different challenge. I challenge myself to come here to see if I could do something different with a new team, and I'm very happy. Where does this title rank amongst all the T20 titles that you have won? Well, I think this will be right up there, even though I won a lot. Uh, this one will be special because, again, it's a new franchise I'm out of my comfort zone. And, um, you know, coming here, not knowing what to expect, I think this is a, maybe the top three because, again, it's a youngish team, couple of like seniors, but this means, I know how much this means to guys of Shellon Cottrell has been here for nine years, Devon Thomas has been here for six years, Evan Lewis, seven years, you know, and then I have the universe boss, Chris Gale, who's been here, leave and come back. I always wanted the opportunity for both of us to play CPL together. Now we're on the same team and now we are champions together. So, like I said, you know, the universe was on the champion in one team. One thing can happen. <laughs> yeah, the real champion. Uh, 500 T20 matches for you today, Dwayne Bravo. And you mentioned Chris Gale closely following you in terms of uh, those T20 matches. How, how special is this for you looking on and seeing the younger players in your team today standing up? and bringing victory to you at the, at the business end of the tournament? Yeah, very special because if you look at it, we lose Chris early. Um, you know, we lose Evan early, who was the, the main player for us. Um, you know, I, I am sure at that point in time, St. Lucia maybe think that, um, you know, they had the game in their hands. But again, we keep believing. Um, all this, our message to all the dressing room, don't matter what, take the game deep. You guys have talent, as we see, we play a batter short because we believe that, you know, in a, in a surface like this, they need the protection with the extra bowler. I'm not bowling, so I needed that as a captain. I think Jagasa had an outstanding tournament, the impact that he came in as an off spinner. Fawad Ahmed and Nassim with his pace, um, you know, got to give credit to him so as well. So again, it was a great, great team effort. To the coach, Simon Helmer, this is our second time, second title together. Um, you know, and I'm very happy to work with a coach like that. And, um, you know, just for the Queens, <laughs> they, they plan, but I guess their plans backfire. So, the Queens, sorry, I have five trophies, I can lend them one. <laughs> right, finally, I know that you're, you're going to go off to the IPL and then uh, participate uh, for the West Indies in that upcoming ICC T20 World Cup. Yeah. Um, just, just, just a word on the Caribbean Premier League and the success of the tournament this year. Yeah, this was a very good one. I think um, if you look at the tournament, how, how close it was from the very last game, you never know who was going to be in the top four. Um, normally, teams fight to get into the top two, but we didn't need to be in the top two, but the top four. And um, again, a final coming on to the last ball. This is what the fans want. This is what people want. So. Um, very good. I think um, people now will look forward to an next CPL 2022. Congratulations again, Dwayne Bravo. Don't go anywhere. I'll now invite uh, the members of the Patriots team to come forward onto the stage before the captain, Dwayne Bravo, goes to lift the trophy. Ladies and gentlemen, the Hero CPL 2021 champions, St. Kitts and Nevis Patriots.